Cat5 and Cat6 cables are both types of Ethernet cable used to connect devices in a wired network. While they serve the same purpose, there are several key differences. In this video, we're going to have a look at what those differences are. Please do subscribe if you haven't already, it really helps this small channel grow. Let's start with cable construction. Cat5 cables consist of four twisted pairs of copper wires. Cat6 cables also consist of four twisted pairs of copper wires. However, the twists are more typically wound than those in Cat5 cables, which further reduces interference. They also have a plastic piece in the center of the cable construction that separates the pairs. It is designed to keep the twisted pairs separate in order to increase performance by minimizing what is known as internal crosstalk or interference inside the cable. Now let's look at speed. Cat5 cables support data transfer speeds of 1 gigabit per second, whereas Cat6 cables are designed for higher performance and can transfer data at a speed of 10 gigabits per second. Cat5 cables can support their max speed of 1 gigabit per second up to 100 meters of cable length. Cat6 can also support its max speed of 10 gigabits per second up to 100 meters. If the cable is longer than this, a slowdown or signal degradation is to be expected. How much this will slow down and impact you varies wildly on the quality of the cable. Both cables are backwards compatible, meaning they can be used for much older networking equipment. Now let's look at interference, also known as crosstalk. Cat5 cables are more susceptible to interference and crosstalk compared to Cat6 cables. This means that in high traffic or noisy environments, Cat5 may experience more signal degradation, leading to slower speeds or loss of signal completely. Finally, let's look at cost. Cat5 cables are generally less expensive than Cat6 cables due to their lower specifications and performance. However, the future proofing offered by Cat6 cables high speed and bandwidth makes Cat6 the recommended choice unless you're on an extremely limited budget. I have left a link in the description to the Cat6 cable I use personally if you're looking for one. I will earn a small commission from this at no extra cost to you. Please do subscribe if you've enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.